I'm a mobile app developer with over three years of professional experience, and I chose mobile app dev instead of web dev for one simple reason. I genuinely find mobile apps fascinating. They're just fun to work on. We all know that passion doesn't pay the rent. So I had to research the app developer job market and salaries to see if learning mobile app development was a good idea. Before we get to it, I did this research before the 2020 lockdown, but it is more valid today than ever before because the lockdown highlighted the importance of online presence. In case you haven't noticed, every business is now online and many are going mobile first. And I'm not talking about Amazon or Shopify. I'm talking about fast food restaurants, insurance companies, gas stations, and parking apps. Yes, parking lots have mobile apps that you can pay with. I also live in the US where everyone has a phone and kids get their first phones at around 12 years old. Americans just want to do everything on their phones and I'm here for that. All right, and now that we know there is demand for mobile apps and mobile app developers, let's take a look at the salaries. According to Glassdoor, the median salary for a mobile app developer in America is $106,000 a year. And I currently make more than that. I can't tell you how much exactly, but I can make a video on my salary progression as a software engineer. Let me know if you want to see that. To recap, I enjoy building mobile apps. There is demand for app developers and the pay is good. I don't know about you, but this is a winning combination. And this is why I chose to learn and build mobile apps. I know I haven't compared mobile app dev to web dev, but they are essentially the same. It all comes down to your preference and your local job market. If you enjoy building websites and there is demand for web developers in your local market, by all means, go for it. And that is all for today. And in my next video, I'm going to talk about my tech stack and why Flutter is a great choice. So subscribe right now and I'll see you next time. <sighs>